Walking down this quiet street in Brooklyn, you'd never know that inside this building, within this tiny apartment, music is made. Meet Evan and Luke. They're longtime friends and roommates. Evan and I have been living together here for, how many years have we been living together, man? About a year and a half. A year and a half. And once a month, in only about 500 square feet, they managed to pile in up to 60 musicians for the ultimate recording session. So I think we can should put five or six people in the bathroom. For each arrangement, we record it in about three hours and uh, post it online. A lot of people's reactions are that it seems crazy, and it is crazy. To pull this off, first, they have to uproot their humble abode. Anything that is not involved in making music has to go. We take all the furniture out, and we take most of the doors off. It's just all about making as much room and as much sight lines as possible. It really just looks like chaos. There's mic stands everywhere. The floor is littered with music stands. I'm a little worried about this, though. There's not a single inch to spare. And that's because they make way for the strings, woodwinds, horns, percussion, and a full chorus. Yeah, that's a marimba in the kitchen. But why? I wanted an opportunity to record a bunch of people at the same time. Luke wanted an opportunity to hear his arrangements played. And so we just invited a bunch of people over. And although it seems unconventional, there's a reason for the madness. We're trying to change the way that you might see an orchestra play. There is a special dynamic and, and a feeling in the room that you won't get in a recording studio or in a public venue. It's this unique sound and sense of community that has attracted musicians from all over the country to participate. There's definitely something really exciting about the idea that this shouldn't really be possible. It's a really unique experience, and I think that people are drawn to that. And so they keep at it. It'll find me, find me. It's a real uh, kind of jarring, wonderful experience every time, and we love it. And I bet the neighbors must love it too. They're lucky they're good. <laughs>